Hi folks, Patrick Barrett here, your favorite driver education guru and author and creator of the ever popular Driver Red in the Box. Back with a little coaching tip today for you. And this has to do with reading the traffic signs and understanding what they are. You know, we, we kind of take that for granted if we've been driving for a while. And this was a comment I got back this week uh, from one of our clients and she wrote, this was a student, uh, Michaela, thank you dear. Uh, so I found the chapter about signs most valuable because before Driver's Ed, I didn't really know what some of the signs stood for. Now, of course, that is the purpose of going through a course like this, so that you learn to understand what the signs are, how to interpret them, what they mean, what the warnings are, what the information signs are, you know, what the different colors mean, you know, what a stop sign means, what a yield sign means, all the lights, you need to know all this. The thing that's important that I want you to understand is as a parent or as an instructor is how many signs maybe you're not used to reading. I mean, after a while, we get into certain patterns of behavior, and we just ignore the signs, okay? It's, I've noticed when I work with experienced drivers, that tends to be the case. Like, well, what, you ask them what the speed limit sign is. Well, I just know what it is on the road. I'm just moving with the flow of traffic. I don't have any paying any attention to the sign. And it's not just the speed limit signs you want to be aware of. You want to start to read the other signs also. So just make a little more conscious effort to read your signs and understand that the beginner, when they're starting out, you know, that's gonna, they may have to think a little bit about what those signs mean until they get used to knowing exactly what they mean, what the colors stand for, what the difference is between a warning and a regulatory sign. Okay, so remember that if you need any additional resources at all, anything at all to help you help your son or daughter become a collision-free driver and to save someone's life, go to www.driveredinabox.com. Get one of our resources. Let us help you save someone's life. And when you practice, how do you practice? Practice like your life depends on it, because it does. This is Patrick Barrett saying bye now.